I think the key thing is to listen, to be comfortable and listen where people are coming from. Sometimes if it's a difficult question, you might want to pause and rephrase uh, where they're coming from because ultimately you want to get some understanding. You might not have the answer yourself as long as you can recognize and understand where that person is coming from. Then you can, if you don't have the answer, you can direct them to someone who could have the answer. There also is a good technique of Michael Bushmold, who's a speech teacher and goes around the world teaching, and he, he comes and volunteers his time to help our uh, loaned executives. And he says to substitute the word but with and. You might have heard that before. Because uh, oftentimes when people get in a tense situation, they say, I hear where you're coming from, but I have a different perspective, or I understand what you're saying, but it negates pretty much everything they said and kind of gets the people on edge. So you can substitute it with and. So for example, I understand your point and I have a different perspective. Or uh, that's a good point and let's look at it from a different perspective. It just softens, it doesn't negate what they said, it, it allows you the time to maybe redirect it in a different way. I wish more schools would teach speaking at an earlier age because it's used, it, it's not always you're in front of 100 people, 200 people, but in everyday business you're interacting with people, maybe one or two, three or four, and, and to coordinate your thoughts and to really listen and engage people is important, and I think you learn that in speech. And so I, I would be a proponent of all high schools and, and certainly in college too, but I'd like to see people at a much younger age. And it is one thing I think our U.S. system does offer speech, whereas in Asia, and I would argue the Asian system is much stronger in math and science, yet they don't cover speech a lot. And that's why uh, Michael Bushmold and other people tend to go over there and train them how to speak, because in business they're forced to do it and they don't have a background of doing it so much.